Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. On February 21, 2024, senior Iranian officials, as disclosed by the Twitter account Ozan Defender, confirmed the transfer of over 400 short- and medium-range ballistic missiles to Russia since early January. These include numerous Fateh 110 variants and several Zolfag R road mobile solid fuel short range ballistic missiles, intended for deployment during the ongoing conflict in Ukraine. Additionally, they announced plans for further shipments, indicating a deepening military collaboration between the two nations in the forthcoming months. This declaration aligns with earlier observations by the editorial team of Army Recognition on January 10, 2024, which coincided with reports of Russia acquiring ballistic missiles from North Korea. This underscores Moscow's endeavors to diversify its military acquisitions and bolster strategic partnerships with other nations, while also suggesting potential limitations in Russia's domestic missile production capacity to meet operational demands. Despite substantial advancements in its defense industry in recent months, with expansion initiatives slated to continue throughout 2024, Russia appears to face challenges in fulfilling the escalating demand for military hardware, particularly ballistic missiles crucial in recent strikes on Ukrainian infrastructure. Consequently, Russia is seeking international support akin to Ukraine, with Iran and North Korea responding affirmatively. Some sources indicate that the ballistic missiles transferred could be Zulfikars. The Zulfagar, an Iranian-developed short-range ballistic missile in service since 2017, boasts notable technical and operational attributes. Measuring 10.3 meters in length and 0.68 meters in diameter, the Zulfagar demonstrates exceptional maneuverability for its class. It utilizes a single-stage solid propulsion system. Renowned for its reliability and simplified maintenance compared to liquid propulsion systems, with an operational range of approximately 700 kilometers, coupled with its precision, the Zulfag R effectively targets medium distance objectives with an estimated margin of error of 100 meters (CEP). Accuracy is paramount for missile efficacy, and the Zulfag R employs a guidance system integrating inertial navigation (INS) with GPS positioning to enhance target striking accuracy. It's noteworthy that the Zulfag R isn't the first Iranian weapon deployed by Russia in Ukraine. Since the onset of the Ukrainian conflict in February 2022, Russia has employed Iranian-produced Shahed-136 suicide drones in combat operations against the Ukrainian military, despite Iran's denial of weapon provision to Russia for Ukrainian operations. Defense and security ties between Moscow and Tehran have flourished since the early 1960s. In recent years, Russia has engaged in joint ventures with Iran for the development of weapon systems, solidifying long-standing military cooperation now intensifying in the Ukrainian theater prompting fresh inquiries into regional power balances and military strategies. That's all for now. See you later.